Good morning. Welcome back to English class. I'm Jay, teaching English for grade three and five in Kanam Elementary School. How's your day going? Are you excited for this weekend coming? What are you planning for this weekend? Let's start today's lesson. This week we are in chapter five. I want an airplane. We are learning how to say what you wish for special days like birthday and any other anniversaries. Today we are in section three. It's for reading, talking, and writing words and phrases. But first, let's start a review with a game. Let's have a quick review for our key phrases in this chapter. Read the sentences together. What do you want for special day? What do you want for your birthday? I want an object. I want an airplane. This is for you. Now we have a game of hidden pictures. You are going to see a picture, but it's perfectly hidden under the shapes. And then it's going to show a bit by bit. All the pictures are related to our key expressions in this chapter. So when you figure out what the picture is about, then say the complete sentence out loud. Are you ready? Let's go. This is for you. Next one. What do you want for Children's Day? I want an airplane. I want a helicopter. I want a soccer ball. What do you want for your birthday? I want a comic book. Good job. Now let's go to our textbooks. Today we are in pages 62 and 63. A. Listen and read. There are two dialogues, so we make this conversation together. First, you play the mother's role and then switch the role. So in the second turn, you play 
the boys' role. Ready? Let's go. A helicopter. I want a helicopter. Now switch the role. Ready? Go. What do you want for Children's Day? An airplane. You are the mother and I'm the boy. Ready? Go. I want a helicopter. Now let's switch. Ready? Go. What do you want for Children's Day? Next one. A baseball glove. Ready? Go. I want a baseball glove. And switch the role. Ready? Go. What do you want for Children's Day? A comic book. Ready? Question. I want a comic book. Now you are the boy and I'm the mother. Ready? Go. What do you want for Children's Day? Right. Now you are this mother and I'm this boy. Ready? Go. Thank you. Good job. B. Read and do. Read the sentences and look at the pictures. Then choose one word matching to each picture. Press pause to answer. Let's check. First, read the questions together. What do you want for Children's Day? And number one. Do you want a helicopter or a comic book? Yes, I want a helicopter. And number two. Do you want a bicycle or an airplane? Yes, I want an airplane. Number three. Do you want a watch or a baseball glove? Yes, I want a baseball glove. Let's check. Good job. C. Read and write. Now, there is a crossword puzzle in number one. So, listen to the audio and then find the present of each number. And fill in the boxes with letters of spelling of the word. One. Airplane. 2. Comic book 3. Helicopter 4. Baseball glove Okay, now let's listen again. 1. Airplane 2. Comic book 3. Helicopter 4. Baseball glove Press pause to write. Okay, what was number 1? Yes, airplane. And how do we spell airplane? Yes, A-I-R-P-L-A-N-E. Good job. And what was number 2? Yes comic book. And how do we spell comic book? C-O-M-I-C-P 
P-O-O-K. Good. And what was number three? Yes, helicopter. So how do we spell helicopter? H-E-L-I-C-O-P-T-E-R. And the last one, what is number four? Yes, baseball glove. So how do we spell it? B-A-S-E-B-A-L-L -L and G-L-O-V-E. Good job. Now let's correct the mistakes in these sentences. Read the sentences of number one and number two. What do you think the mistake is? Find it out and correct it. Press pause to write. Okay, now let's check. What's the common mistake in number one and number two? Yes, the punctuation is wrong. It should be a question mark at the end of number one. Why? Because it's a question. Okay, so let's correct it. And number two. What's the mistake? Yes, the sentence should be end with a period, not a question mark. Why? Because it's not a question. So let's correct the mistake. Let's check. Good job. That is the lesson for today. Thanks for being here and I'll see you next time in section 4. Have a nice day. Goodbye.